Meghan Markle is loving being at the end of those games with Prince Harry. Finally, after months of secret meet UPS behind palace gates, Prince Harry and Meghan Markle officially debuted their romance to the world, sending the wedding rumors into overdrive. Meghan, 36, couldn't have looked happier as she cheered on her boyfriend Harry, 33, as he opened his beloved 2017 and those games at the Air Canada Centre in Toronto, Canada on Saturday, September 23. And now, we've learned that she's having a great time there with her handsome man. U.S. Air Force Master SGD. Kyle Burnett, 37, told People, I asked Harry how his girlfriend was enjoying it and he said, she loves it, she's loving the games, which is awesome. So cute. Due to the couple not being married just yet Royal Protocol dictates that Meghan couldn't be seated with Harry in his VIP box during the event, but the star was only a few feet away from her man and joined by her best friend Marcus Sanderson, who is the mutual friend responsible for introducing them. Meghan positively beamed with pride that day when Harry took to the stage to address the crowd with an inspirational speech. You are all winners. You are in vitos, Harry said as Meghan clapped and smiled. Watch more of Harry's in vitos games speech in the video below. Harry, who was seated with FLOTU's Melania Trump and Canadian Prime Minister Justin Trudeau, was seen looking down at Meghan, who was just four rows below him. Although Meghan and Harry were not next to each other. The soup star was assigned one of Harry's Scotland Yard protection officers who, along with three other bodyguards, looked after her security during the event. Don't worry, though. They were later seen holding hands and sitting next to each other. According to the Daily Mail, royal protection officers are traditionally only tasked with looking after royal family members so the fact they're protecting Meghan, who is technically a citizen, is yet another huge sign of just how serious they are. Meghan looked stunning in a plum-colored mackage leather jacket worth a cool $689 draped over her shoulders and a chic maroon dress. And the actress is really making the most of having Harry in Toronto, where she filmed suits. According to Hello! magazine, earlier in the week the royal made a low-key visit to the show's set. He's incredibly supportive of her work. Meghan showed him around set. Everyone was so excited, an insider told the publication. This was a massive milestone for the pair, who have been dating for just over a year, as it marked their first official outing. Until now, Meghan and Harry have gone to great lengths not be seen together and have only been sighted in public together a few times. In March, Meghan joined Harry as his plus one for his best mate Tom in Skip's wedding in Jamaica's Montego Bay. In May, the actress was spotted cheering on her man from the stands at a charity polo match in Ascot, England. Most recently, they jetted off on a romantic holiday for Meghan's 36th birthday, spending three weeks traveling around Africa. They also enjoyed a brief stay at Queen Elizabeth's Scottish Highlands estate in Balmoral, with speculation rife he could have introduced Meghan to his grandmother. And now, the Invitos Games makes for a very fitting debut, considering they first hit it off at the 2016 event. Having Meghan at his beloved sporting event, which Prince William's younger brother launched in 2014 for wounded servicemen and women, further proves just how serious the lovers are. Parts of this post were written by Bella Brennan. It originally appeared on our sister's site, Now to Love. Join our Facebook group for the latest updates on Kate Middleton, Prince William, and all things royal.